Hey, mad men sparing none. Basically, it's gonna be a spirit of stopping the weapons, you know. Um, some Jake was in the military. You even got certain brothers in the truth that was in the military, you know. But 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 brothers in the truth are men of the Lord, though. That's the difference. Esau Edom are not creating a whole army of robots for the average, you know, Jake's out here, man. They're doing all that for brothers is gonna receive that power, man. You know. That's why they're going to be like mad men sparing none. Basically, it's going to be a spirit of stopping the power. The same spirit that was on the Pharaoh, you know, around the time when uh, when Moses was uh, was being born, you know. And they even showed you in that damn, you know, kids film. I had to use the word kid, you know. But they even showed you in that so-called children's movie, you know, The Prince of Egypt, you know. They had those Egyptians, you know, slaying the babies, man. Well, basically, they showed you this one scene in particular that Moses uh, had walked past. They showed you how the Egyptians were feeding those Hebrew babies to alligators. Showing you what Esau Edom did here in America, that was nothing new. Okay? That was nothing new. You know, the, the Pharaoh... During the time of uh, the, the Exodus, you know, you know, well, there were different pharaohs, okay? You got to think about it. There were different pharaohs. And in the kingdom, we'll know everything exactly as far as the names of the pharaohs. Right now, we could say Ramses II and, you know, we, we could say that. But, you know, we'll know in detail when Yahweh Shah come, all right? But around the time when, when Pharaoh was born, though, not Pharaoh, excuse me, around the time when Moses was born, Salaki, when Moses was born, they showed you. The Pharaoh of that time, he wanted to destroy any type of power coming from the Hebrews. Okay? Because power, power comes through the male. You know, power comes from men. That's why they were slaying the Hebrew boys. They were not slaying the uh the Hebrew girls. They were slaying the boys because power comes through the man. You know? Same thing during the time of our Lord, Yahweh Shai. When Yahweh Shai was being born, you know, around the time of his birth, you know, the, uh, one of the the, uh, the Herods of, of that time, which, which I, I'm going to look into the specifics of it, you know, um, I got to go back into the history now, you know, but um, but, but the Herod of, of that time, you know, of the Lord's uh, birth, basically, he issued a uh, an, uh, an edict that um the, you know the same thing that you know the Pharaoh of Egypt declared slay all the uh the Hebrew boys, you know? Slay slay all those Israelite sons. What was it uh four year four years old and under, if I'm not mistaken? So in this time right now, which Herod was a damn Edomite, by the way. There may have been Herod the Great, but I want to get it precisely for what it say. I'm going to go into the history on it, you know. In this time, you know, the Edomites in this time, they're going to do the same thing, okay? They come in the spirit of the ancient, you know, uh, Egyptians. They come in the spirit of Pharaoh. They come in the spirit of Herod, which Herod was an Edomite any damn way. <coughs> they come in the spirit of the Romans because these are the Romans anyway. They're going to be like madmen sparing none. Why? To stop the power. They tired of us prophesying. You know, so, so now they want to do something. But it's too fucking late, devil. <coughs> the truth is out now. Ain't nothing you can do about it. I don't give a damn if you got Jake friends, you know.